Well, it's Tuesday the 5th of May, folks. We're just going for a walk along the canal now, having a little vlog. Um, just going to cut across the cobble car park to get down here. So I take for a little walk along the, um, the Castlefield Canal, folks. Um, yeah, I'm just using my head mount. There's a lot of barges down here and stuff. Been doing a few photos today on my phone. Not brought the big camera. I'm just not in the mood for that at the minute. Just not in the right frame of mind. Um, so I'm just doing a few on my phone. I'd like to thank everyone for the love and support as well. Um, beautiful. Nice weather, nice sunny day. Shame we're on lockdown, that bars, restaurants are not open, folks, because this would have been a perfect day to have a nice pub lunch. Or a nice pub lunch and a nice pint, or a nice cocktail, or a nice roof terrace, or a nice beer garden. But any old Al, we're just down here along the canal side, folks. Having a little walk along this side of the canal. Um, Just enjoying the beautiful <coughs> you know and uh, for ever changing sounds of Manchester City Centre with the building work I'm going just to our right over the, over the water there A lot of them um, building work in people's homes along here, building new part apartments for all the posh gets. Um, um, yeah, the police have been on patrol today as well down here. Um, it's a bit windy like, but it's nice, the breeze is gorgeous. It's quite warm, the breeze. It's quite a warm breeze, but nice. So I'm sorry about the noise, folks, but just having a lot of vlog while we're walking. Um, Bridge just just to the right of us there, but it crosses the span. We're going over the old bridge here that um, used to lead into Pump House. What led underground originally? Um, there was pump pumps and stuff in here, um, and that. But we're just out vlogging, I'm having a walk. And yeah, folks, there's the old wheel and stuff in there. And there's the old tunnels that are blocked off now. That's the old tunnels that are blocked. Yeah, that's the old workings there. Well, it's for the old mill. It's actually uh, stunning down here today, Fox. Just going to get a quick photo while I'm here. On wide mode for that one. There we go. Put it back on normal. In fact, flat. We've got to wide mode. There we go. About the bridge shot. Back to normal mode. Right, there we go. Yeah, there's an old wheel just up straight ahead of us there in the wall from when the old mill was on top of there. Part of the old mill still survives just here, folks. That I think is offices or apartments now. Just to the left of us. Um, this this side of the canal here used to go down there underground as well. Um, but that's all been blocked up, sealed off, and what have you now. Um, you get quite a lot of drugs, drinkers down here and stuff. But hey ho, it's not as bad as Smackhead Tunnel. It's not it's not as bad as Smackhead Tunnel as it's formerly known as up at Piccadilly Basin. As People who are local will know it by that name because you see smackheads, druggies all injecting and stuff down there. It's just a beautiful chilled out thing, folks. A bit windy, but hey ho, we're enjoying the walk and stuff. Thank you. 
beautiful today folks I've done quite a lot of photos along here using the old railway um, pillars just directly to just slightly to the left of us and just to the left of us all but just underneath the bridge there is um, a big bicycle statue um, up here it used to be one of what's not open at the minute is um, a roast dry. what roast fresh coffee beans you can actually buy the roast coffee beans off them buy the sack load and stuff and buy the bag from them and the coffee absolutely beautiful normally up it smells like um, a cuss between burnt toast sort of smell and a normal toast sort of smell along here what comes from the the, the roaster the, the coffee roast house up here that's underneath one, one of the old arches um, very beautiful strong coffee from there gorgeous flavour, full flavour, full body coffee yes you know me folks by now with these vlogs I love my coffee and I've already had four cups of coffee since being out and before I left I've had two cups of coffee before I left so that's six that's I've had two cold cans of coffee and oh no wait yeah yeah I've had two cold cans of coffee and I've had four cups of coffee I had two before I left and two when I've been out so that's six cups of coffee as you know what I'm like for drinking coffee by now but um, we're just on our way to see if this little shop thing here is open I think it's a co-op or a mini Tesco and see if um, we can get some cold coffee yes you hear that correct again folks me and my cold coffee we're going to get some cold coffee hopefully <coughs> yeah um, yeah all this round here is changed just underneath the arches here is Deansgate Locks just over there is Deansgate Locks El Dorado club there used to be Shug, Sugar Buddy next door to Lola Lola used to be called Sugar Buddy and I've done the doors at Sugar Buddy I've done the doors at Lola Lola as well um, but hey oh it's like quite on our right night on these get locks but you do get quite a lot of young silver spoons shoved up their ass posh little students um who think they're beginning hard who think they can bottle you in glass shop but just there folks is where the coffee shop normally is is just there but like i said though i can't even smell it i just know where i'm going now i'm navigating by by memory because i ain't got my smells to follow no more from my shops and everything so it is a lot of mental strain and a lot of mental effort to navigate and there's no public toilets open there's no cafes restaurants or anything open where you can get and if it was you can go and use the toilet so you just gotta go where you gotta go for the toilet folks and there's a weird shaped mirrored building in front of us with a round balcony on the top of it like a dome sort of shape it's always been like that for years um, yeah so it's just a nice beautiful day anyway share the love folks keep some love folks so I was unable to get my coffee from the Sainsbury's of how night it was due to the fact of I weren't going in the shop because there's too many druggies outside the shop or begging the bottom end of Oxford Road from the Palace Theatre down on Oxford Road, the Tesco's all along that section there where the McDonald's is from, from the McDonald's on Oxford Road all the way down on both sides big groups of 8 to 10 druggies all sort of there begging so now they've moved from Piccadilly the Gardens to Oxford Road folks so if you don't like that sort of thing and you don't want to be pestered when you're going shopping then just avoid that area um, we're just walking past this crap old Midlands the crappy Midlands as I call it because it is crap, the staff quality in there is crap for a four star hotel the quality of staff is worse than a one star for staff quality in there um, but hey ho 
we're here we're just on the way down to spinning fields now folks um sharing the love as always um just about to go and get the bus home because it's a bit hot get in for a cold coffee like um i may go and try the same resort tesco is just down the road here um not got my chest mount on today so it won't be secret filming i'm using my head mount um what was a bit of a mistake in my head sweating using it but hey ho um yeah so we're just on the way down we're just on that side there folks to the left is nightingale hospital manchester for you what's down there the former g max now an hospital was formerly a warehouse and a, a, tra a train yard it's from a train station that but this is it's absolutely madness so it's absolutely quiet anyway share the love peace and love from black brother 2226 we'll share the love peace and love yeah well folks we've been to the little task goals just off dean's gate near the opera house got me two cans of double shot of starbucks espresso coffee um very nice staff in there not always but they were today very lovely young lad in there very polite understanding yeah more than willing to be helpful with me um i just don't understand it at a minute folks why people are accepting british currency this is britain ain't it I've, the last i knew it was anyway we're just going over the mighty Irwell. just down there is the lowry hotel my first ever job as a chef working at that hotel in the kitchens and this bridge folks i absolutely hate it especially when joggers go over it because it's dead bouncer doesn't feel safe or secure just there folks is a bench in the middle of the bridge over the uh, well the once famous mark Addy pub what always gets flooded what's abandoned just there um yeah so we're just walking down for the bus now folks it's, i don't like this bridge never have never will it does look nice though at night time because it does have lights on it and that but it's just doesn't feel right to me this bridge um and all down here as well as under lighting as well across the seat seen areas what looks nice at night time and that and i'll show you this now folks um this little memorial graffiti artwork here just across the way from the pump house museum what was I think it was the first pump house in Manchester city centre because it's on the other side of the world, so that's in Manchester. We are now in Salford, officially on the old border. Just there's the old Mark Addy pub. Folks, I just say we have bees with a love art. Sharing the love. Love art bees, folks. Lovely. Lovely. Beautiful. Yeah, there's the old entrance to the Mark Addy pub. Anyway, stay tuned for more thoughts, share the love, peace and love. I did my way. This is how we do it, folks. In the theater of dreams. I did it my way. Go and follow me on Instagram and YouTube, folks. Apply the phone 22, 26. Go and share, share the love, peace and love, folks. One love, one heart, one nation, peace out.